Opportunity and confidence, that equals to Devante Graham in the season 2019-2020. Devante Graham has been one of these overnight successes who has been years in the making. Hey guys, I'm Marcus and welcome back to another video. Today I'm talking about Devante Graham and how he went from being an overlooked high school player to being now one of the most improved players in the NBA. If you are new to this channel, subscribe so you won't miss my next video. With all that out of the way, let's get straight into it. Devontae Terrell Graham is a basketball player who plays the point guard position. He was born in February 1995 in Raleigh, North Carolina. He is 6 foot 1 inches tall and weighs 195 pounds. Throughout his whole career, high school, college and now in the NBA, he always had the number 4. Devontae and his mother had a hard time growing up, mainly because his mother was mother at 14 years old. Devontae Graham's mother was barely 14 years old and had just finished the 8th grade when she became pregnant with Devontae. A child raising a child. She'd be taught how to raise a baby before she even finished puberty or learned how to drive. But despite this scenario, King refused to let it overwhelm her. She worked two jobs, graduated high school and went to college, all while providing food, clothes and most importantly a mother to love her son. Despite that hard time growing up, Devante fell in love with the game of basketball. He only was 5 foot 6 and played a broken high. He was one of those players who let his promising teammates shine. He took a step back and let them score most of the points. Because of his size and underwhelming stat sheets, his teammates were scouted by glamorous schools. Then Devontae Graham grew to 6 foot. With that, Devontae steadily improved himself. He was getting a better and better player so that bigger high school programs were interested in him. He eventually went to Brewster Academy. At Brewster, he had better coaches and better surroundings. So he was still getting better and better and better. Now he finally was scouted by big D1 colleges like Virginia Tech, Virginia, Providence, North Carolina State and Kansas. He then narrowed down his choices to Virginia, North Carolina State and Kansas. The first one didn't wow him, the second one were too close to home. Then it was Kansas with coach Bill Self who impressed Devontae and his mother. It was a win-win situation for both because Kansas were in need of a point guard. Coming to Devontae Graham's career in Kansas. Devontae played the whole four years in college for Kansas. The fit in Kansas was pretty good. He improved from year to year. At first, he built a backcourt with Frank Mason III, who plays now in Milwaukee. Then, in his senior year, he averaged 17 points and 7 assists per game. With this deadline, he leads his team to the Final Four. Overall, in his Kansas career, he had a record of 122 wins to 23 losses. Pretty impressive. So then, at 23 years old, he reached the 2018 NBA Draft. Then, because of his high school time in Brewster and his four years in college, Devontae said that he only improved as a basketball player and as a person. Devontae Graham was drafted in the second round, 34th overall in the 2018 NBA Draft by the Atlanta Hawks, but then was traded to the Charlotte Hornets. As a second round pick, the expectations were not that high. But Graham's performances were still very underwhelming. With the all-star point guard Campbell Walker, it was clear that Devontae Graham would not get a lot of minutes in his rookie year. In that year, he averaged only 4.7 points, 1.4 rebounds and 2.6 assists while playing just 14.7 minutes per game. His shooting stats were also very disappointing. Graham shot 34.3 points from the field, 28.1% from three and 76.1% free throws. And he smashed the like button one time per video to help me out with the YouTube algorithm. Because of the whole situation with Campbell and his underwhelming performances, he only played in 46 NBA games for the Charlotte Hornets. The remainder of the season, Devontae played in the G League for the Greensboro Swarm. Against this weaker competition, he proved that he had a lot of potential. In his 13 games for the Swarms, he scored 23.3 points, grabbed 4.6 rebounds and dished 4.9 assists per game. Then a big change happened for Devontae Graham and the Charlotte Hornets. Their long-time franchise player and all-star Campbell Walker wanted to get traded. The Boston Celtics 
were the lucky ones which traded Terry Rogier for Kemba. This trade looked like a big L for the Hornets. The next season didn't look too bright for the Charlotte Hornets. With a lot of young players which don't look to have the potential to reach an all-star level and mediocre players like Nicolas Patum or Bismarck Biombo. But Devontae Graham showed that the Hornets have something to look forward to. He shook the whole NBA with his recent performances and by destroying the like button. Now Devontae Graham is leading the Hornets in points, assists, 3 point percentage and minutes per game. He has 19.9 .9 points. 3.8 rebounds and 7.6 assists, shooting 41.1% from the field, 42.2% from three and 81.9% free throws, while playing 33.9 minutes per game. This is a very, very big increase to his rookie season, making him one of the hot candidates to win most improved player of the year. He already had three games with more than 30 points. He also has 7 double doubles to this point. His most memorable game this season was against the Brooklyn Nets. Brooklyn was up as much as 20 points in the second quarter. But Graham was catching fire in the second half, scoring 27 points and single-handedly won the game for his team with 40 points, 5 rebounds and 5 assists. Temple watching Graham. 37 for Graham, 24 in the second half. Shot clock is down to three. Graham lets it fly. Pure! Devontae Graham is not human! Now Devontae Graham is no longer a secret in the NBA and a lot of teams letting their best defenders guard Devontae Graham. The whole Devontae Graham story is showing that they are a lot of paths to reach the NBA. Just look at this comparison with Andrew Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins was a one and done player. That means that unlike Graham's four years in college, Wiggins only played one season for the Jayhawks. He then was picked with the first overall pick of the 2014 NBA draft by the Cleveland Cavaliers and then later was traded in exchange for all-star Kevin Love. Both Devontae Graham and Andrew Wiggins were born in February of 1995. And that journey hardly could be more different. But now they both are stars in the NBA. You never know how or when players are going to get it. That's the beauty of the NBA. Also a beauty of the league right now is Luka Doncic. Check out my other video to find out how he could become the youngest MVP in the league's history.